Hello, everybody. Welcome to Fred the movie. One of them. No, actually, all three of them. Jim. I know. Fred, the YouTuber, turns movie. He turned into a movie. Yep. Oh, God. Let's a go. Hi, it's Fred. Today is Friday. Oh, my God. Say that fast. It sounds like Fred Day. Friday? Fred Day? Why does it look way older than it is? It looks like the first Smosh video. He looks like corn. Fred. Fred Durst. Yeah. Whoa, is that Fred's house? Yeah, we just doxed him. He's right there. <laughs> Fred's house. School. Heck yeah, we know even more now. That was so overexposed. That is a theme. That is going to be a theme that every shot is overexposed. Awesome. I forgot Jeanette McCurdy was in this. That's at least one redeeming factor. Yeah, there's a lot of like famous people in this for no reason. Judy. That is Judy. I forgot about Judy. How could you forget about Judy? Because I haven't watched character. Fred since 2008. I have never willingly sat through these movies, and this is not changing that. Uh, my mom turned it on thinking, hey, he'll like this. And I was like, that was bad. And she was like, yeah. Why are you stalking her? <laughs> you are actively stalking her. Pav, you're looking for Dream. Is Dream actually Fred? No, he's actually Shane Dawson. How does he keep getting ahead of this car? Fast. Um, he lives in a really walkable neighborhood. Those don't exist. What are you talking about? Clay Wiener. <laughs> <laughs> Directed by Clay Wiener. <laughs> sure was. This movie's a Clay Wiener. A Clay Wiener production. Well, that's Fred Durst. No, that's Kevin. Wait, why is this hat painted on? Oh my God, it is. What? What? There's no way that hat looks like that. Hey, look, I shot better looking video when I was 10 years old. This movie was shot on the hit camera, the Nikon Cool Picks. <laughs> you might not have been able to tell, but that girl that I walked home with, that hat. Hi. Girl. Did I just see the, like the border of the. Oh. It's low resolution. <laughs> they just scaled up a PNG. I know a Clay Wiener directed this, but like, do better. Wow. Please. The budget for this movie was lower than this video. Probably. I'm taking things to the next level with Judy. No, you're a stalker and a criminal. We've been inseparable lately. But I, maybe I'll, I'll just have it next Yeah, we aren't really say. sure yet. Ow. How did they pitch up Fred's voice, but not the girl that was talking next to him? How? How did it's they do that? He sounds like that. Naturally. How did they do that? It must have been very difficult for him to go back in and record every single one of these lines. You notice it's completely dead silent outside the music in his voice. Like there's no room noise. It's just like him and a mic. Yeah. Couldn't have added like a light AC or something to make me feel like this wasn't a YouTube video. I mean, they could have made it not feel like a YouTube video by not having a jump cut every two seconds. Yeah, he could have not talked to the camera. I get what they were going for where they are like, let's make it like the videos, but better. What's that alien on the side over there? It's an alien on the side over Hi, they really like that PNG of Judy. They couldn't get a better one. You know what? Uh, I just want a PNG of Thomas that scales up <laughs> right now. Unfortunately, that's her picture is too high resolution. I'm going to have to send it through the crustifier before I do that. See, that was kind of funny. Those are french fries and nothing else. Why does he have a picture of a breakfast burrito on his fridge? It's just a breakfast burrito. Why? He was like, yeah, this will be funny in about 10 years. Whoa. Just beyond that wall over there is Judy's house. She's only a few feet away. Hey, they probably built that wall because of you. They put up that wall to keep us apart. Yeah, okay, yeah, there we go. What does it look like I'm doing, Bertha? Bertha! You're not going swimming? No, I'm not going swimming. I really want her voice to cut out every time she drops below the fence. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that I'm laughing at this movie. I want to hate it. It is funny. Shut. It's funny. No. <laughs> it's funny. I'm not. telling you, Brendan, it is funny. You will enjoy Fred. What do you think I should do? The secret is ruthless aggression. It is? No. Did they put makeup over his nipples? Because where are they? For the audience and you guys, um, the original rip of this movie is 480p and it's just been upscaled. So like some of the weird smoothness is that. I I'm a good singer. No! Ow! <laughs> No! Murders his son. Domestic abuse, but it's kind of funny. It is you who take mere words and make them melodious love. 
Are you with me? Can this movie like cut like no. where it doesn't feel awkward? We looked at Fred for one millisecond and then it cut back to John Cena. It's like if I cut between all these cameras like every single frame. Cut back who? Cut back. To who? I came into this world as a recheck. Look, Look into, into these eyes. eyes. <laughs> Who is this for? Uh, not me. The 80-year-olds that are watching Fred the movie. That's who this is for. I'm going to go over to Judy's house and invite her over to sing with me. Okay, what are you going to Judy's house for a little play day, huh? How are you guys gonna do that? <laughs> kind of how Andrew Garfield talks all the time. Also, his hat keeps rotating between <laughs> shots. It just keeps going around slowly. So it was there? Yeah. And then it was there. <laughs> He's been slowly rotating it around. Oh, it's moved again. What did he do? Did he like have to get undressed and redressed in between every single shot? I like to think every time the camera cuts to Fred, he's just like. <laughs> was gonna attack me. Although I don't know why anyone would want to. Maybe because of your voice. His mom's the most based character in this movie so far. In the original Fred YouTube videos, his mom was like a drug addict. Like very explicitly in this movie, it's kind of hinted at. Yeah, she had like a low voice and she was just a voiceover and I kind of liked that better. <laughs> My time is now. He could literally kill you from right there. How did they get John Cena to do this? Money. They didn't put money into anything but John Cena for this movie. Also, John Cena knows he's a meme, so he just does whatever. Oh, absolutely. Was John Cena such a meme in 2010? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, WWE is a meme in and of itself. I'm going to use this to make a flying leap over the fence. Walk. Yeah, you could, like, walk up to her front door. No, because Kevin's over there. <laughs> Jump. I'm gonna be honest, I could walk up to that wall and climb over it in like two seconds. Also, Lucas is like fairly tall, isn't he? He could just... Like they're making an effort to not let him stand next to that wall that's shorter than him. I guess I have to find a better disguise. I know his mom is a weirdo, but what are those cloves? Goat. Work. Do it, please. Get a job. <laughs> Contribute to the economic system. That's what swag is. Welcome to swag or not swag. That is swag. Sorry, hearing the word swag not as like a joke, but as a term for anything hurts still. It's like when companies used to call their merchandise swag. Like pick up some neat swag from our merch store. Gotta call the police and the cops and the FBI. Why are there so many cuts? Yeah, but it's clearly one take of audio. At least like do the 10% punch in each time to make it a little bit better. So the writing on this isn't near as bad as I expected. It's pretty funny. But yeah, it's like the actual technical side of this movie is so bad on every level. Well, good thing we're watching Fred for the lore and not the amazing <laughs> oh cinematography. Okay. Judy moved! Where to? I don't know. They I really want the original audio of this grown man screaming. <laughs> well, I was, okay, so we can slow it down a little bit, but unlike the YouTube videos, which are just sped up to make it faster, they're pitching him up using like a plug-in. Why did you tell me? So when I slow it down, it just sounds like four minute shifts down. Why did you tell me? <laughs> he does like a slight like valley girl type accent and then it gets pitched up and that's how you do the Fred voice. It's still terrifying when he, you actually hear him scream. <laughs> I'm stuck. I can help you. <laughs> there, you're free. You know, if I was his parent, I would really hope that he loves his new foster family. Wasn't it the first Fred video where he like just says, I need medication like 50 times in a row? Yes. They made this so PG compared to actual Fred. Wait, Fred is still like archived on YouTube to watch? Hey, it's Fred! Shut up! Featuring the annoying orange? Yeah. Yeah, they collabed. This is the first Fred video. I'm Fred. And mom, I'm not using your camera! Yeah, as I was saying, I'm Fred. This is so much slower than I remember it being. Well, I mean, this is his first one. I'm sure they got faster later. Oh, on. some of them were insane. So if we like skip ahead just like a little bit. Hey, it's Fred! That's the one I was thinking of. Yeah, this is the first one I saw. He had merch already. This was ahead of his time, honestly. I'm scared of Fred now. Like, this is so calculated, everything he did. I have a condition where I need to take pills to activate like a normal human. Earlier today, I drew a picture of a guy. Hurting a little kid, and my teacher was like, 
waiting for school. So yeah, his original videos were like a lot darker. Yeah, I re that's how I remember Fred, not like, eh. John Cena. <laughs> <laughs> kind of funny that they tamed down Fred, but it's like still Fred, but his therapist stops giving him medication and then he starts to slowly descend. I need my medication! I need my medication! Just like stabbing people. Freddy, please go to sleep. And my heart is broken. And my heart Fred! Mm. It's go time! He's getting drafted. Oh, actually, okay. <laughs> I was kidding, movie. Live Jude reaction. I like the idea that he just has a Humvee parked in the garage at all times for this occasion. Muzzle flash. Yeah, uh, the bullets aren't moving. What a crazy dream. It was a dream, that's why. I found Judy's address on this map. Where? I can't even see that. Well, yeah, because if you could, you'd be able to dox Fred. Yeah, you can. we can't look at his Google map. He just typed in the, into maps, let me see house. I have no idea how long it's going to take me to get to Judy's house, so I'm just preparing for the worst. <laughs> it is a couple blocks away. Why are you getting, like, cans of nothing? Travel. Where is his dad at any given time? If it wasn't clear yet, his dad that is kind of like imaginary. Yeah. It's really weird. He's like kind of insane, like legitimately where he's just imagining all these situations. Yeah, that's why he needs medication. He's schizophrenic. <sighs> Isn't it summer? Why do you have a, why do you have a parka? Travel. Travel. He doesn't know how long it's going to take for the travel. Judy. Yeah, he explodes because he's never been outside before. Joke's on you. There was a landmine right there. <laughs> he was Outside, like in the last scene. Yeah. yeah, he's been outside for like 80% of this movie so far. Someone dug through his concrete porch and just placed a landmine under the under the welcome mat. Where are you going anyway? Why do you care? I'm not gonna tell you. All right, then I'll just follow you all the way there. How'd you like that? It's the weirdest dynamic. Yeah, Kevin's an actual like dweeb and Fred's insane. So this is just the worst two people in the world. Yeah. Uh-oh, I'm supposed to be on the number seven bus. I know Fred's an idiot, but buses go on a route. And you know what that means is that the bus will end up back at the bus stop that he got uh, on it. This bus actually just keeps going to new places constantly. It's a one way bus. <laughs> it never stops at the same place yeah. twice. Do you want to try something cool? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> She's dead. I'm gonna be honest, as creepy as Fred is, he kind of deserved that. I'm just imagining this in like normal life, though, just a dude just buried in the sand. Someone just walks in and <laughs> kicks him in the face. Kevin let the intrusive thoughts win with that one. <laughs> <laughs> I've always wanted to do this. Same. This is Mace! I will spray you. No! I will spray you in the eye! I cannot believe they got the people in this movie that they did. Yeah, I know. People that have done real things. What? You don't think Fred the movie is a real thing? I mean, according to, like, everywhere it is, and you cannot find this movie. No, they've been trying to destroy every trace of this film. I hate to say this because it's freaking Fred. This has... This... Aside from whatever this is, uh, has a... I was about to say this has potential to be really fun, but then that happened. I was like in the middle of that thought. What, you're saying this is not one of the shots? Uh, I mean, I will forgive it for being in Fred's head, potentially, because I think a lot of what's happening is in Fred's head. Uh, there's yeah, a party yeah. that you were invited to! Yeah, everybody, pull out pull out your iPhone 3GSs for that. <laughs> no, it has to be the iPhone 3G that couldn't take video. Oh, my God. They're just taking still frames of this. Wow, he totally just threw up on them. Wah, wah. Can you guess where the story is going to go from here? So now that he realizes Judy and her friends suck, uh, he's going to fall in love with goth girl because that's everyone's arc. The things that happened at the party, what do you think is going to happen now? Oh, uh, he's going to go viral he's gonna because go viral. he vomited after getting bullied. Viral video time. Like, look how terrible we're being to this kid. Quick scope sniper intervention sound effect. Oh, no, they weren't that self-aware yet for another couple years. What? That did not need a jump cut. <laughs> yes, it did. I don't want to jump cut myself off a bridge. <laughs> 
the quietest rage he's had. You leave this completely uncut, and he just has a full-on mental breakdown, and the movie fades to black. It's just the darkest, creepiest. No, see, then, then, then you hear, yeah, you hear him like cock a gun, and then it fades to black. It's dangerously good. <laughs> that was so humiliating. There it is. I kind of wish he hadn't screamed here, and they had left some emotional weight to that. Kev, smell my fart. What's his name? <laughs> oh, 360p, heck yeah. Kev, smell my fart? I would subscribe to Kev, smell my fart. My new gamer tag. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. I mean, there's going to be lots of games and food and music. And we're going to do a lot of illegal stuff. Kids our age can't do it, but we're going to do it anyway. You said illegal stuff. Are we going to, like, skateboard in the non-skateboarding area? We're going to cross the street, not at a crosswalk. We're going to get kicked out by, like, a mall cop. It's going to be great. What is this? Your dis invitation. I'm having a party and you can't come. This is the pettiest thing. I love it so much. You're like, I'm having a party and you're not invited and just leave. Do this with wedding invitations. You're like, hey, just want you to know. It is with great honors that we invite you to stay out. What's up, moron? <laughs> Bertha. Hi. Hey, Fred. What's up? You're invited to my party. Never was gonna invite you anyway. See ya. God, what did she do? Besides bury you in sand, which was really funny, honestly. It was objectively funny. Bro, burning bridges that aren't even built. Would you, maybe? Like, you can just come to party, maybe just for a little bit. You don't have to stay the whole time, but... Redemption arc. <laughs> it took four seconds. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, Bertha's always been kind of into it. Yeah, he was actively just mean to her, and she was like, cool. <laughs> We're having a party. <laughs> We're having a party. Do we talk about you having a party? That thing had the audacity to say HD on it. <laughs> <laughs> the nerve. No, it's not. No, it's not. It was HD for the time. No. No. Yeah, no. <laughs> HD has a definition, like a literal definition. Yeah, high definition. It has to be at least 720p. 720p? That's a lot of P. I have to pee. No, we can't leave the couch until all three are done. Piss in the air like a fountain if you don't. If you do it six feet in the air straight up and not get wet, you get no down payment. On what? I get no down payment. Am I selling you something? <laughs> That's kind of funny. That, that was a pretty good bit. They're just like making a fake party. <laughs> Why are they blending a cosmopolitan? They're making confetti, I know, but check out this transition, man. Some of this is funny. I get it, but it's going on for a little too long. This is the world's longest montage. I think this is the first time we've seen an unironic star wipe. In a, I mean, it, uh, kind it's of kind ironic. of ironic, yeah. Are they just going in there and changing and coming out the back and then going back? <laughs> yes. <laughs> nice one. Oh my god. What is that? That is... That says premiere. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna be real though. If you made it gray, it's the same UI. You're not wrong. It's kind of the same. <laughs> premiere. Exactly the same as it's always been. <laughs> Was not the entire point of you making this to, is to send it? Yeah, but now we get to see it. Would you be convinced that this was a party? This looks like two people in a basement. This is like all those videos from TwitchCon. Oh, Dr. Disrespect isn't filming in the bathroom. Come on. <laughs> Do the luddy. Fred's about to hit the gritty. Again, this montage is way too long. Yeah, thank you. Holy crap, this goes on for a while. Where's the, like, really hard drugs towards the end of this? Lawrence! School. Lawrence Dull. Mid. Mid really fell off. Fell off. Me, me when I needed it, he did the mid sign. Oh, it was an epic fail of me not to go to Fred's. It was an epic fail. Um, that just happened. <laughs> but how are we going to get to the movie? <laughs> well, that's an oddball. <laughs> Is it envelope or envelope? Depends on who you are. Uh, okay, so if you're right, is it envelope or envelope? It depends on your dialect and where you're from. If you are correct. You know? Is it envelope or envelope? I don't care that I wasn't invited to Fred's party. I don't know why everyone's asking me that. I cannot wait for the climax of this movie to be everyone figuring out the party was fake, and then he's sad. It's a diary of a wimpy kid, I lied moment. Fred isn't what we expected. Fred is exactly what I expected. Hi, Fred. Can I come in? Like into my house? Is she gonna wake up again or is this real? I actually don't remember. I think this one's real. Just hold on one second, okay? Sure. Scream right now. <laughs> yep, can you imagine she hears that muffled scream from the other side? <laughs> I came into the 
this world is a reject. Look into these eyes. <laughs> okay. We made it through one. Yeah. That was the worst ending to that movie that could have happened. You're right. Where's Bertha? Uh, at her house. Glad we're friends now. They had this fake party, the bonding moment and everything. Yeah, plot twist. Bertha and Kevin are going to get together. Ew. It's going to be one of those stories where like it's like with the disappointing end where they end up as like friends. It's La La Land. No, this is just any sitcom past season three. <laughs> when are Rachel and the annoying guy going to get together? Oh, my. We're gonna watch Fred 2, Night of the Living Fred. And I'm gonna eat a sandwich. Fred 2. Fred is, there's more. This is the Halloween one. Oh my God, a studio had something to do with this. I'm so sorry. Gears, 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 gears of war. Hey, it's Fred. My life is a horror movie. It's so scary. I'm so scared. They put like six more dollars into this movie, apparently. There's a color grade. <laughs> Oh my god. Judy exploded. She's dead now. Oh my god. Holy crap, dude. She exploded. Like from the movie. Which one? The one where the people explode. I have seen that movie. Oh, go, Fred. I'm sorry, Judy, but I can't be tied down. They couldn't get the Judy actors, so they just. That's why they broke up. It's kind of like how in Transformers 3, Sam has a new girlfriend. <laughs> Is it explained why he has a new uh, one? It, it, she didn't like that um, Michael Bay directed the movie, and that's the, the in lore explanation as to why they broke up. Oh my damn it, I wasn't expecting this to be good, but it's amazing. You've got to try this. Is that peanut butter, jelly, and ketchup on a zinger? I can't tell because of the color of this. I don't know what that is. It was made out of food. Somebody in the comments is going to be like, obviously it was it was jam. Y'all are wrong. I could tell it was jam the whole time. Um, Actually, The Master of Disguise is a great movie. Nerd emoji. Why did he have an umbrella in the daytime? I don't know if I... No, that's not Bertha. That's someone else. That's the girl from Victorious. It is. It's the girl who plays the same character in Victorious because Nickelodeon has like five people they can use. A duel. <sighs> oh my God. This reminds me of VGHS where the law was just really dopey and stupid the whole time. And it was the best thing ever. Like you have no reason to hate him. He's a little annoying, but like <laughs> he's just stupid. And I love it. Okay. <sighs> <laughs> what was that fart sound effect? Uh, that was the fart sound effect. Can you promise me that was not you? Can you promise? Look at the timeline. Nothing there. You could have rendered it back out with the farts in it. <laughs> you rendered this whole thing out with the breaks in between, so I don't believe you. Do you like cookies? Uh, I made you a cookie in chemistry class. Why did you hand him like a ball of freaking foil? Put it in a box or something. This is cursed. Oh, it's the Halloween movie. Movie. This isn't scary, it's just crap. It was his idea for me to invite you to this little welcoming party we're having for the new music teacher, Mr. Devlin, tonight. Mr. Devlin, because he's de the dev when when you Satan. I'm Devlin Bowman. I have a cave full of rare objects. <laughs> I have what? a cave full of rare artifacts. What is that from? What that's am your, I? That's Master of Disguise. Yeah, the greatest oh, movie of all awesome. time. Oh, I blocked awesome. everything from that movie out of my head. I haven't even read your stupid comments about how it's good. Out of all the things we've watched, that is the one we've gotten the most negative feedback about. Go defend something better, like Home Alone 5. What am I gonna do? <laughs> You're gonna go there. You're gonna <laughs> trying to survive the nukes. Come on, you've seen Indiana yeah, Jones. Yeah, Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. Skull Kingdom of the 2000 something. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that movie, that movie came came out. it did. Wait, Dad. You can't see me. <laughs> yeah, I can. There you go. Sunny D. All right. Oh my God. Didn't he do a Sunny D commercial? Yeah, I liked Sunny D until I like gained 10 pounds off of it. Yeah, it's almost like it's sugar. I remember our Sunny D era. <gasps> what are you doing in my house, Fred? I have to use the restroom. Is this the restroom? You know what? I'm thinking I'm gonna kick you out of here, Fred. No. This is like the most juvenile argument I've ever heard. Like, I have to pee. Is this where I pee? Oh. Roasted. <laughs> dies in every scene. Why are you asleep at 10.30? What are you, five plus 10? Middle of the night. 10.30, the middle of the night. It's like the middle of the sunset, basically. Did he murder her for her cat? Who are you talking to down there? No one. Talking to the people. All that 
your activity made me hungry for a midnight snack. In the world are you cooking for 15 seconds? What is that a pancake? He made pancakes in 15 seconds. That's pretty quick. Is he going to put pancake oh, juice on them? Yeah, he is. is. What is going on with my pancakes? If you stab the pancakes, then Davy Jones dies. Oh, ah! God. That looks so bad. This looks worse than Geico commercials. How did you make this? <laughs> I'm not hungry for pancakes anymore. I wouldn't either if you made them with 15 seconds of microwave time and then a woman climbed out of them. Ready to go to class? She's like, oh, he had another episodic break. <laughs> you, got another, you got another manic episode. Anyway, can you, you want to go to math now? Friend. What? <laughs> Touch grass. <laughs> I can't. I eat it all. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Devlin is a vampire! <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Actually, really good. Like, this is a really good bit. Just the way it's shot and everything. <laughs> <laughs> I've got dancing pecs. This mystical tattoo. This is kind of what the first Captain America movie looks like in its entirety when he yeah, got just gray. Well, no, just like the way they like slap the head on a oh, different yeah. body for half of it. Or are we going to get the really fast running that looks terrible? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> he turned into a squirrel. Oh, my God. This isn't even dated. This is just funny. <laughs> Animorphs be like. None of Fred is dated. It's always going to be good. It's going to be good. Yeah, you're forever. right. Fred is never dated. Just like Among Us. The joke that will last forever. <laughs> That is a Monty Python reference. Yeah, it is. I haven't even seen Monty Python, and I know that. Yeah, it's because there's, like, this weird obsession with Monty Python because it was the first thing to ever be funny. <laughs> You're not wrong. It's, it. like, the first thing to have a dry sense of humor it, for some reason. Yeah. Devlin in my home? Well, he'll never be invited. Hello, Ski. <laughs> everything... All right. It's a very loaded question to ask Fred. It's like, I'm a music teacher, and I'm just trying to go on a date for the first time because I'm a music teacher, and this kid's just doing that. All of my music teachers were married. They're either married or divorced forever. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, come on. Let's not stop the party before it even gets started. <laughs> Put these in something moist. Stop. Stop. Not like find a vase. Put these in water. Find a sponge that you've recently cleaned with and just... That'll keep him alive. Well, maybe you shouldn't have brought this. It's for parking birth on my kickstand broke. An anchor. Hardly know her. To park the bike. I want a full size, like, shipping, like, freight a anchor boat. Uh, yeah. 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 You want one of those? <laughs> yeah. Those are, like, as big as this apartment. Good. I would like a shipping ship. Super rare. Like, blue. Bloody. And uh, hold the garlic fries, please. I want the, like, arcade craniac sound effect to play there. Like, the. <laughs> yeah. Drinking the Among Us potion at 4 a.m. It's even scarier now. 3.15. 3.17. 3.28. PM. So just like midday <laughs> yeah. on a Wednesday. So scary. So far, I liked the first movie better. Yeah, same. Yeah, this is kind of mid. Feels like a really long TV show episode. Yeah, you're not wrong. This feels like the middle. Wow, it feels like the middle. I don't know if it's the house or if it's just the way it's filmed, but it looks and feels exactly like the middle. There would be funny jokes, and then at the end of the show, they'd be like, sometimes with family, you don't get along. And that was like every episode. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that's wow. You really said something today. Hey, how was the fish? Wait. How did you know that I ordered fish? I have mental tilapia. You have mental illness, maybe. Well, that's what tilapia is. I don't mental know. Illness? <laughs> if you go up to someone and say, I have mental tilapia, they're going to go, yeah, mental, mental illness. Dad! I need your help. Well, that's no coincidence, son, because I need your help. This Sunday night. John! The arena. <laughs> Bruh, was this a real thing? I don't know. I feel like it would have been. It's WWE, and the amount of people that are still unsure about it being fake kills me. I like how they just have the logo bug and everything. Just We even got the, the fireworks breaking the bit rate and everything. That was perfect. Is The Undertaker going to show up? No, no, it's Devlin and Kevin. Can't spell Halloween without WWE. <laughs> I'm sure Lucas is having the time of his life right now. I would have so much fun with that. Like, actually. I can't imagine, like, what 
you would feel after being in WWE. Me, personally, I would be dead. Like, full disclosure, yeah, it's fake, duh. The athleticism that goes into WWE is very real. Like, I cannot imagine what you would feel for days. Oh, I would actually die, but I think it'd be fun. It'd be, that'd be the best way to go. What is? Just get pile-driven? Dr pile-driven. <laughs> I'm going to get a pint of blood from each of the kids. Oh, like a vampire, if you ask me. Vampires need to live too, Fred. No, they don't. They're dead already. No, they don't. They're dead already. Yeah, they are. They're uh, not. They're uh, they're dead. They're uh, they're not. So they're not dead because they already died, which means they're not dead. Which they're means dead. they're um, un undead. Dead. Yeah. So they're alive. Yeah. Not rebooted. Well, enough joking around. I have to get going. I'll see you guys later. Literally, this guy just has a dry sense of humor, and Fred just does not know how to handle this. Yeah. He's not screaming and like flailing after every single joke, so Fred does not understand it. Yeah, this guy's just playing along with everything, and Fred's like, <laughs> Gather your forces! Take this! It'll make you go fast. Oh my god, a ripstick. Whoa. The least efficient Whoa. mode of transport ever Whoa. invented. No, there is one mode of transportation that is less convenient than that, and it's those scooters that you have to. Go Unicycle. back and forth on in order to go forward. Unicycle. No, at least those can move you faster than one of those hogo stick. Again, you can move forward faster. Yeah, you can move forward into the concrete really fast on those. <laughs> Why? Because <laughs> it's a rip stick. No, no, no. Why the song? See, that's the cool thing about a skateboard. Is that you can just go forwards. Yeah, you can stand there and then wipe out when you hit that lip of the driveway because you're not expecting it. Yeah! I'm alone! Same, dude. <laughs> I want this sound bite like a TikTok audio, just the door slamming. I'm alone! So you're going to put the garlic sauce in the water guns because it's kind of funny. Yeah, that's how you fight the vampires with silver bullets and garlic sauce guns. Why does he have like the lighting rig from a Jeep Wrangler on his back. Because <laughs> he's going to wrangle some vampires. He stole it from the Humvee. Should have just gotten the 50 cal and call it a day. You can't kill a vampire like that. You have to, unless you have silver bullets. Silver is for werewolves, not vampires. Oh, yeah, you're right. Uh, you pour garlic over all of the bullets and then fire them. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. I don't, is silver for vampires too? I don't know. It's not real. I know it's werewolves. Yeah, okay. No. Get out of here. Now, give me the water gun. First of all, this right here isn't a water gun. It's a master blaster. Why don't you just spray him with the garlic? Because either he's a vampire and he will die immediately, or he's not, and this situation will be over. Yep. Easy. Jake, I am so sorry. He hasn't been himself since the day he was born. <laughs> Feel that, bro. <laughs> that was a great That's such a good roast. This might change your mind. Yep, the, the crowd gasp sound one. Uh, <laughs> hey, where's your... Where's... So glad that he's probably imagining this. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Not even aiming at him. It does kind of look like Twilight, honestly. I think that's what they're going for. Yeah, but like the green sauce. hue on everything. <laughs> Garlic sauce. This is better than the roller coaster in the last Yeah, movie. you're right. Does he just like turn to gray? I like how he dies and his sister's like, oh, okay. <laughs> Give me the master blaster or Talia joins the undead. Is this entire movie, I don't know if you've watched it. Is this all imagined? I watched this when I was 12. This whole thing is imagined. I'm going to throw my microphone. Like I said, Fred is schizophrenic. If there are actual vampires in the, the Fred CU. <laughs> Not FCU, just Fred CU. Yeah. yeah. Technically, this is all in WWE's lore anyway, so. Uh, damn it. Human. I I'm, and then you explode and die. I feel bad for that actor who had to say that line. Yeah, with like the standard ignition sound effect. Yeah, and that like video co-pilot, like <laughs> yeah. stock dust. It's just smoke. Dot MP4. This garlic sauce will protect you. It's gonna burn their eyes. Is what it's gonna do. And then they're just gonna smell like Olive Garden for the rest of the night. <laughs> Fred. Do something. Is such an idiot. It's almost like that's his character. I know. What the heck was that all about? 
He's a vampire. He is not a vampire. He deserved to hear more than the word heck for that. No. <laughs> like, he probably did off camera. I don't care where the gamut you got that. It's so bad and I love it. Um, where the gamut isn't actually a real word. I'd like to invite you to dinner at my house tonight. Did you hear that? He wants to bury the hatchet. I'm going to transmit a live video feed of my dinner at Mr. Devlin's. You need to be in an institute. One institute or multiple institutes or an institution. Institute. Hey, that is the colorful iMac that we were talking about earlier. That's why we brought it up. It changed from the other one, though. Yeah, they, they upgraded to another equally old computer that looks a little better on camera. And by looks better, I mean it looks like those Power A cheap controllers that you can buy. I like the way they look. Yeah, but I don't like the way they feel. You don't hug your monitor. Yeah, but like I know it's made out of garbage. If I see a monitor made of Power A controller <laughs> material. The Power Mac G4 was made out of <laughs> Nyko controllers. Hello, ski friend. Welcome to my home. Yeah, he doesn't act like a vampire. He just acts like a music like, teacher like a band kid i mean so does fred but you know <laughs> the two types of band kid i have two sides yeah the one that's talented and the one that's not that's a lot of blood you gotta watch figglehorn's website right now man i'm watching it it's creeping me out if you like fred you'll love fred live i love that part in fred when fred said it's figgling time and he figgled all over the place time to dig up dinner <laughs> You watching this? Why didn't like his mom come with him? She wasn't invited. Hey student, come to my house alone. Without the woman I'm dating, who happens to be your mom. Your mom. I'm not touching that. Who is in there? This is such an elaborate prank that this guy is pulling pretty much. He spoiled it. I thought he might have been a real vampire. He thought he was a real vampire. I have some bad news for you. He's a fake vampire. He's a vampire. A vampire? It's when you catch the baseballs. Yep. No one ever goes for the door. What are you doing, man? Live reaction. Oh no, he's a butcher. Why does he have like teal, like RGB lights in his butcher place? Plot. Blood. Oh! Rib. Oh wow, he just left that boiling. It's an experiment. It's Yoda! He's got a lightsaber and everything. Yeah, that lightsaber that would cast a shadow. Yeah. The thing made out of light that casts a shadow. Actually, it's superheated plasma. Oh, 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 oh. Which causes light to happen. No. I see you discovered my secret kitchen. Pretty neat, right? Why do you have katanas? What a weeb. It's like the movie Disturbia where he just has a random middle part to his house for no reason. What do you say we go cook this up, huh? And on the way, I will tell you about my traditional headdress. So he's just a weeb. You didn't, yeah, I mean, I figured that out when he spoke for the first time. <laughs> yeah. The bat was injured, so I nursed it back to health. I tried to let it leave. Look at all the coincidences that led up to Fred thinking he was a vampire. Is this entire thing going to be like a metaphor for like not judging a book by its cover? That's going to be like the moral of the story and he's going to scream and fall down the stairs. It is Fred. There is no more. The last movie, he ended up with the girl that he really wasn't supposed to in every version of that type of story. When I play music, I stop being an outsider. When I play music, I stop being an outsider. I'm actually an inside. It, it's ruining all the nuance of any art form when you explain it outright. It's like music helps people who are damaged escape from their damage. It's like, let it exist the way it is. We know. Bro really had one thing happen with like six people and then sold his house. No, a thousand views is so much, dude. Wow. I hope this video has at least a thousand views. Guys, if we can get this video to one like, <laughs> that'd be cool. This video only has a thousand views. We've done something very wrong. Can't you stand by and let this happen? I ruined a man's life by falsely accusing him of being a vampire. I don't know, maybe apologize and tell people you were wrong. Oh, yeah, see how close you were to the camera just then? Do that, and then cry, and then you're golden. Stop teleporting around the room. This is like what Vlogbrothers wishes they were. No. Yeah, John Green, you know, he wishes he was this good at jump cuts. Yeah. I can't imagine having to move my chair every four seconds while we're recording. I'm going to convince everyone that I'm a vampire so they're mad at me and scared of me and so they can focus on me and blame me so Mr. Dufflin can have his life back. Maybe. Just apologize. I'm in. 
vampire disguises. You just had that? I mean, he's a YouTuber who does scripted skits, so probably. It's a lot of corn syrup. Corn, 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 corn. Yeah, we got another one of these that are way too long. How do I look? Oh, uh, lose the Spock years. Too much? Yeah, okay. I don't like this movie because <laughs> it has so many just fake outs that I can't just like th get invested in anything. This entire movie is a fake out. This is the last Jedi of the Fred trilogy. Honestly, yeah. The writing was better in the first one, but the cinematography was terrible and this one's kind of the opposite. Yeah. yeah. The third one is just going to be the conjunction of both. Or they'll it'll all be kind of mid. I feel like this movie should have ended when they found out he wasn't a vampire. Oh my god, it's Fred in a lot of makeup. Wow. Oh. You know this funny prank that could get you like killed right now? You've got to stop him! Join me tonight in the undead! Yeah, go kill Fred. But you can't, because my powers are more intense. Potion seller? Yes. My powers cancel out your powers. You cannot handle my potions. Potion seller, I don't want to sell her. <laughs> Kevin's just, like, actually traumatized at the moment. Oh, yeah. I mean, more than he already was, but, you know. Wow, it worked. We almost got, like, killed by someone with a <laughs> weed whacker. It worked so well. Yeah. Mission accomplished, guys. We traumatized, like, nine people. <laughs> Kevin kind of deserves it. Yeah, at the end of the movie, you know, the uh, Devlin guy is going to, like, look at the camera and then turn into a bat all of a sudden, you know? He's going to morb away. He's going to look at the camera and then wink and then turn into a bat and fly away into the moon. Yeah, and it'll be a freeze frame as he's flying towards the camera. <laughs> it'll say the end while we're looking at the moon. I need a woman who's going to challenge me a little more. We, we know, we know. All they were missing was a giant neon arrow pointing at her. It's like YouTube thumbnail, like, Wee! does he know? <laughs> <laughs> Why were those trash cans full of only they dust? They were so dusty. <laughs> there was only dust. There's nothing else in there. They put like a concrete bag in there, like a bag of quick creep. Gotta get you a 50 pound bag of quick creep. Hello, Ski. Hello, Ski yourself. Joke's on you. I was moving out so I can move in. Oh. <laughs> we don't need two houses. No, they're just going to build like a sky bridge between the two houses and put their bedroom in the sky bridge. Oh, he's not in the mirror. He's not in the mirror. Let me get the door. You know what I want for when he screams? <laughs> Just a Weezer? Yes. Wow. Well, we've got two down. You, you're you breaking the illusion. He's got to poop really bad. Holy crap, guys. It's Camp Free. Camp, camp Free. Fred. Wow, Camp Rock. Can't wait. Fred 3, Camp Fred 3. We've obviously been on the couch the entire time and haven't moved, which is why I'm in a whole different outfit. Yeah. So yeah. We're, in, we're in the end game now. Gears, 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 gears. Are you ready for Fred the Musical? Oh no! Is there no a lot of music in this one? What is that lamp? What is that lamp? Today is my favorite day. I do hope it's not cliche. Is his voice a little lower in this one? It feels like it's being put into a song, so probably. What year? Twenty twelve. Wow, these were really fastly produced. Yeah, if they both came out in twenty twelve. No, two thousand ten, two thousand eleven, two thousand twelve. It's like COD games why they keep getting worse. Yeah, so the decade began with Fred, and then there was one Fred movie a year until this one. No wonder that was like the worst decade of my life. Fred! <laughs> Morning, Mom. You know how Mr. Beast videos have like a new shot every other second for retention? <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's just for the Fred movies. <laughs> You're not wrong at all. When, when are we going to get the Mr. Beast movie? If he didn't edit his videos where there's a new shot every other second, there would be a Mr. Beast movie. I mean, yeah. I wouldn't mind a, a Mr. Beast movie starring Chris Pratt as Mr. Beast. You know how Mr. Beast is like alive and a real person? No, no. Chris Pratt has to play Mr. Beast. You have to pick someone a little hotter than the original person or something. Well, you don't think Jimmy Beast is the hottest I didn't person say alive? That. <laughs> that microwave is older than the one in the last movie. Like a lot older. De-aged. He has gotten poorer. It on thawed. Exponentially. So much that his, they had to buy worse, older stuff. Should I do it? Should I go get the microwave out of my bathroom for the final movie? I think you should just record like a little video of it. No more wet willies, spitballs in your hair. The last day they'll hang you by your eyes. When did High School Musical come out? Uh, 06. Okay, so I was wondering if this was like a trend that they were trying to hook on to. 
This is feeling more like a TV show somehow. Camp Fred sounds like a TV show. Is this the same girl? Uh, from the second one, yeah. Can you believe I'm actually going to Camp Superior? Did you know it was named the top summer camp? TARDIS case, TARDIS case. When I was packing for this trip, uh, Lulu got in my bag and laid down, so I just zipped her up in it. <laughs> Good. Keanu knew I was leaving, so he just sat on top of my suitcase the whole time. See, when I was packing for this trip, I put my phone in my pocket. And then you moved everything out here. Yeah, this trip to the living room. Oh, a special appearance by WWE superstar John Cena. You know, as if he hasn't been in all three of these. It's a special appearance. It's way too expensive. So I signed you up for camp. I want a pee pee. Uh, this is so unfair. This is going to be the worst. It's just now occurring to me. Part of me thinks that he's not talking to a camera. Like Kevin's watching him from the other side of the neighborhood. <laughs> Kevin's always there. The vlog format for a movie is interesting. I will say that. The lore goes a lot deeper than you think it does. I, I guess the real vlog movie would be like Ferris Bueller where he's not insane. He just does talk to the camera. Are we going to talk about the Ferris wheel again? The Ferris wheel from Ferris Bueller. Yeah, that's a joke from the future. You'll get it in about a month. Joke from the future. Ferris wheel. Remember that, guys. I mean, I'm not going to let some stupid summer camp bring me down. Woo! You're moving the... What is this, man? I want a PP is on his yeah. shirt. Camp I want a PP. Has it been long enough that we can just sell merch that says I want a PP? Yes. No, we have to sell it as I want to PP, like the full <laughs> words. <laughs> Lucas Crawshank, if you're watching this, please give us permission to use the I want a PP franchise and trademark. <laughs> you can do this, Fred. <laughs> That looked so bad. That looks like a music video from the 90s. This looks like um, Smash Mouth All-Star. That's what I'm thinking of. That is what this looks like. What if we turn the saturation all the way up? <laughs> and then we turn the contrast <laughs> all the way up? <laughs> and then what if we turn the exposure <laughs> all, all the way, way up? up? More color. More is more. Less is more can't be more. More is more. Say less. I'm not going to color grade our videos anymore. I'm just going to leave them gray. Do you have any Clydesdale horses? We don't have Clydesdales, but we do have a horse. His name is Francis, and he only has three legs. Whoa. <laughs> that was Family Guy cutaway formula, though. That was, whoa. I would die for I Francis. I love Francis, but what? So instead of, you know, like motion blurring and moving the frame over, they cut away to a different camera, and then they cut away to just this footage. Oh, that's really easy to not do what they did. Oh, actually, it's a movie, so we can't do any of that easy stuff the YouTubers do. Yeah, we can't make it look good. Good, cause movie. Do you, you have monkey butlers? What? Well, we've been asking Fred to touch grass, and here we finally are. Can I eat it at all? <laughs> I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> camp, I want a pee pee. We're a summer camp on Earth. You can sit with us. I love when movies have this character that knows everything about everything ever for no reason, and they're only there to tell you everything about everything. Yeah, it's mine and Chatter's third year, but Dig and Spoon have been here for four. Four years at this dump? They're acting like they were there all year. Yeah, no, they've been living here for four years. This is their home. Their parents abandoned them here. Every summer, we compete against Camp Superior in a grueling three-day competition called the Summer Camp Games. Oh, good. It's this trope. You Usually they split up the camp itself instead of going and fighting other camps because it doesn't make any sense to have summer camps next to each other like that. Yeah, no, it, the, none of this makes sense, but here we are. Trying to get me! Don't worry about it. That's just Scary Gary the maintenance man. He's harmless. Can you imagine holding your child for the first time <laughs> and you look at them and you're like, oh my gosh, they're so beautiful. What should I name them? Gary. He's old from the time he's born. You like come out of the womb 56 years old with a mortgage or three. You know, see, the thing is, is these jokes are going to age really well because names run in cycles these days. No, Gary will forever be an awful name. So don't name your kids Gary. Best bunk in the cabin. It's the only bunk in the cabin. Now it's really the only bunk in the cabin. <laughs> like the first one, I think Fred humors at its best when all this crap is just happening to him. Oh, yeah, exactly. Instead of him, like, vlogging, him taking a water gun and shooting up a theater with garlic was kind of weird. Such a weird sentence. It was funny, but, like, the stuff that happens to him is funnier to oh, me, yeah. honestly. The circumstances he gets himself into are infinitely funnier than him. Yeah, the stuff that led up to the garlic thing wasn't funny because it was all just him talking. Right, so it didn't feel like... Like, that was really earned for me. No. Oh, I hate this place so much! I hate it more than gym class!
what? Again, people are just walking past the cabin. He's yelling at himself. What is everyone else doing not having their luggage They're in They're having there? friends. Is she just going to be alone in this cabin? Yeah, no one else brought their luggage in. He's just in there screaming. Well, it took him forever to find it. Maybe everyone else already brought their stuff. This place is supposed to be garbage. And then look at that, like, kind of nice ceiling. That is the best part of this entire thing is the ceiling. Yeah, my point being, this is a set and it shows. It'd be like water damage the, the ceiling. The ceiling's the first thing to go in a cabin, not the floor. <laughs> <laughs> no, the rain comes from the ground, dude. <laughs> the dirt is just soaking up the building. It's going to eat it away. I don't care if I have to tunnel my way out of here. Sounded pretty cool there, didn't I? Yep, I can be a pretty bad dude when I want to be. Yes, and you're bad at acting. You know how, like, a lot of YouTuber movies, they're like, what if this has nothing to do with YouTube or movies? And it's like, there just happens to be a YouTuber here and they can't act. Yeah. And Fred movies were just like, what if we made the Fred videos but big? Long, big Fred. Yeah, and then we were like, what if we watched the Fred videos and made a micro society video but big? Big. This is our movie. Welcome to our movie. Yep, this is the movie. There's gonna be, like, 50 mineral ads given the length of this video. <laughs> Good. Have fun. Give us money. Can't wait for the 30 minutes of watch time we get from this. <laughs> Man, I could really use one of my dad's inspirational speeches right now. Hey. Why does he just exclusively live in refrigerators? He saw Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, and he's lived by that standard since. It's like how mirrors are supposed to be like a portal to another dimension. Fridges, every single fridge is a portal to another dimension. Does that mean that John Cena is a wizard? No, no. It just means fridges uh, move wrestlers around. Oh, okay. <laughs> this place is gross, Fred. I can get through it, right? <laughs> this place... You're on your own. Even John Cena can't help you now. He's like, this is the end of my contract. Goodbye. You can't see me. Thanks a lot, Dad. You've been a great help. And in case you can't tell, I'm being sarcastic. <laughs> well, there, there's our subtle hint of the fact that he is actually insane. <laughs> That's beyond subtle. At this <laughs> Fred is going to kill people by oh, the end. Oh, absolutely. Poor mom. He's probably worried sick about me. Is that Pizza Planet? That's the Pizza Planet truck from the hit movie <laughs> Toy Store. Oh, does that say Planet Pizza, though? It says something's pizza. Oh, yeah. Okay. Something, somebody's pizza. I saw the P. I'm like, Planet Pizza. That, that says... Is that... Uh, says, uh, <laughs> rattle them, boys. I hope everyone here dies of disease, and that's how we end this movie. I hope they die of rattle. <laughs> <laughs> They're all gonna get rattled. I hope they die of the disease from the Planet of the Apes movies, and then the apes rise. You know, like in Rise of the Planet of the Apes, when they rise. But what if the apes dawn? You have the head of a crocodile, the body of a bear, and antlers of a moose. Yeah, there's just a nuke going off behind him. <laughs> This Why? looks like I want that costume. Shot on GoPro. Is he about to say he's standing right behind me, isn't it? He's standing right behind me, isn't he? That's an envelope. Friend, friend, you're gonna lose. No, friend, no, friend. You lost the food you can't eat, friend. Your breath reeks, okay? They did the he's right behind me and the bad breath and the goo bit. That's like 50 things. There's something really fishy going on around this camp and I don't like it one bit. Oh my God, is that a commercial break? Yeah. This is a TV show. Well, it was made for TV. You were made for TV. Even witness the staff putting weird blue pills in the food. Now, are you sure the kids won't be able to taste this? That's a protein supplement for... um alpha males, obviously. Yeah, it's brain fuel. It's sigma male vitamins. You betas don't spend $90 a week on protein powder like I do. <laughs> I get mine flown in from Russia. Yeah, like I'm gonna eat that stuff after I found out what they put in it. It's time to get to the bottom of whatever sick, twisted plot is going on around this camp. This isn't even a jump cut. He's just telling Stop. It's like he has the ender pearls. He's just throwing them around. <laughs> Stand in one spot. They've entirely missed what the point of a jump cut is to the point where it's just transcending the sentence. This guy says it feels like his brain is turning into Swiss cheese. And what eats cheese? Rats! And where do rats live? Rat holes. Guys, let us know if you want us to watch Ratatouille, the movie. Rat out a little alley. Rat a -lee -lee. Lee -lee -lee. They serve the gruel to the unsuspecting. 
shaking. He's shaking. He's freaking <laughs> shaking down there holding yeah. that spoon. You can see it. Yeah, he's moving. You can see the other person moving even more. Fred's moving in the shot. It's not Froze fr 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 Frame. It just looks know, like you tried to do it with your friends in middle school. Pills make you sicker and sicker as they slowly turn your brain into Swiss cheese. That's what the vaccines do to them. Oh, have you gotten vaccinated? <laughs> <laughs> that is just brain cancer is what that is. Oh, I'm going to starve to death. I need food. I'll just eat a bunch of these berries, and if I don't end up getting really sick, then I'll know they're safe to eat. Alternatively. No, this is a good idea. Everybody, if there's berries, eat them. No, just Fred. Uh, well, wide angle. We're going to watch him surf in a second. It's way worse than surfing. Do you know what I do when I'm not feeling very good? What's that? I rap. Oh no. I'm a little teapot short and stout. <laughs> here is my handle. Here is my yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> What happened? Why? Um, He got high on the berries. I don't think he was the one particularly who got high for this sequence. Well, it's weird. So it's like they were on drugs. No, th this required a lot of drugs to be okay with it. Down the pipeline, all the people who signed off on this, they were just checked out. They were like, whatever. <laughs> Bro, it ate like a bush, apparently, according to that. A bush. The speed in which that came out of his body. Yeah, we had to see it hit the camera, too. That was great. Yum. <laughs> Night after everyone goes to sleep, let's show Fred what Camp I Want a Pee Pee is all about. To the rat hole. Fred was like, I heard that. Let's take him to the rat hole, boys. Unruly campers get sent to the rat hole. Act like he was unconscious. He was just like laying there and they're like, hey, when Fred's awake, let's rat. Hey, Jude, when Josiah's asleep tonight, uh, <laughs> don't look at him. Hey, don't, don't look at him. He can't hear if you don't look at him. Uh, uh, when Josiah goes to sleep tonight, uh, we can, we should, uh, we, uh, when, when Josiah These goes are going to the, to the same board. I know. <laughs> we should take him to the hole. Take him to, to the... Which one? The hole. The hole? The hole. Which hole? You remind me of the babe. What power? Power of voodoo. Who, Who do, do? You, you do. Drinking water. The raddest thing here. Me too. That's the rock band guitar. Sure is. But you don't know it because there's tape. Crap. Dang it. A uh, regular guitar with... Tape on it. Ten buttons. He tried to pick on the rock band guitar so much because it was just move the thing up and down. Oh, it's so bad. A new shipment's here. <laughs> just like 50 pounds of crack cocaine. Packages of cookies in there and they just chucked it at the floor like that. It's like, oh, pizza, cookies, gummy oh, gummy worms, um, um, military oh. grade <laughs> explosives. It even comes in like a wooden box, which just means danger. I can't believe I'm actually in the same room as... El Diablo. The big one. <laughs> yeah, and then it's gonna rain and they're gonna go, oh man! Why are you doing this during the day? Yeah, it's the worst time to look at a bomb. Also, if everybody like around. <laughs> can't be good. That can't be good. Shut up. It is a bomb. You know it's not going to be good. Um, that just happened. I missed this horse's leg because that's why it only had three legs was for that shot. <laughs> bathroom. <laughs> Does it not explode? It just made a, a, a bathroom fall over. Now, what does Camp Superior have that we don't have here? Spoon, dig, chatter, and me. Is this just going to be Fast and the Furious? Family. Yo, it's family. Family. Uh, that's why we kill people, is because we're family. We're stronger. We're faster. Better dance moves. Wow. That was indeed one of the things someone has done. What the song? This is like when you're about to die in Mega Man. Competition! What? Stop with the cuts. <laughs> yeah, okay, that one was like <laughs> on purpose at I know, least. But oh my god. Wait, what were you gonna say? He's also he's doing the the like awful person thing of where they like wear a hat like this and they're like, it makes me look tough. No, it makes you look like you don't know how to wear a hat. 
bus appears. Suddenly, bus. The bus with all the kids from Superior just appeared after we had a conversation with only some of the the important kids from Superior. I feel like there was something that got cut out in between there, probably. Without further ado, let the games begin! Hunter James. This feels like the end of major pain, and I do not mean that as a compliment. Why is this shirt, like, more washed out than everyone else's? Uh... The real camp games were the javelins we threw along the way. What is this, like, synth music? This doesn't give camp at all. This is giving, like, not camp. I don't know what. This is like a coding camp. I can't wait for, for the last challenge to be worth all the points they need to win. Say we're going to do the camp challenge. Okay, wait. Here it is. Here it is. The, the all or nothing sudden death as they're losing 70 to zero. I really think you guys all did a fantastic job out there today. Do you really mean it? No. <laughs> He's doing the Life is a Highway intro for some reason. I fly the road, it's traveling on this Monday here and next day going the best. We're the worst. No, we're not the worst. There it is. Yep, there it is. Come on, guys, we're the best. We're so good with our yellow shirts and red headbands and high-pitched voices. All of our voices should be pitched up by one semitone this entire video. No. Just by one no. semitone where you, like, barely notice no. it. No. Because I will not want to watch our own video. It'll annoy you me. tune my voice up, I tune your employment down to no. <laughs> <laughs> the movie gets up by a semitone, too. We just do everything. No, the movie gets put down by a semitone. Oh, it'll be out of tune. Fred 3 and G flat. Oh, wow. They're getting a bunch of pandered, catered competitions like burping. There's a loop. Can you imagine being the poor sound engineer that's like, hey, you have to make a nine second burp. Can you do that? Uh, why is the camp leader from the other camp allowed to be the judge for the competition? Because... They're superior, so they get to make the final decision. It's Fred 3, dude. I don't know. <laughs> She's a little criminal! You're a giant man! Giant. The other ones are like actual sports and events. Is the next one going to be hole digging? They're going to have like a not brushing your teeth competition. Is Fred's challenge going to be like the schizophrenia challenge? <laughs> the schizophrenia challenge? Whoever hears the most voices gets 10 points. Hold my stuff, and then he hands his stuff to nobody. They're like, never mind, you win. Parkery. Yeah. When has Fred ever shown any ability? This for is gonna be a fluke. I can't do this. Wait, it's 2012, and Fred has a bow too, like everyone else that year. <laughs> there's a bow. Yeah, there's like Brave, Hunger Games, Avengers did it too, all in the same year. And now Fred also has a bow. He is the best bow character in 2012. I hate that I've never noticed this before. You didn't notice the bow thing in 2012? I noticed the, everyone ripping off Hunger Games, but I didn't notice the bow specifically being in everything. Bow and arrows for one year were really popular and then just went away forever. Now it's like multiverses. That's our current trend. I'm so tired of it. It's like the Matrix from the movie The Matrix when there was a Matrix in The Matrix. Forget everything you know about about the Matrix. <laughs> Serene place. Pull the bow back. Where are you pulling? You're like holding it left handed and then you're Chow! pulling it. <laughs> oh my God. Only meant to do that. As someone that has used a bow and arrow before. Arrows don't just ricochet off of anything like that. They can bounce off of things, but you have to be really good. Not like that. No, not like that. This year will be a songwriting competition. The winning camp will be awarded 30 points. <laughs> Why is it worth 30? Because it's just enough for them to win. You know this camp that has nothing to do with music? Yeah. Yeah. And no one has shown any musical abilities so far, aside from Fred. And he was bad in the last one, too, so... Mm. Wow. Beat, it's a note and a drum. <laughs> do, 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 do. Yo, yo, I love to rap. Rapity rap when a track gives you a big slap. There you go. More words. When did they make the beat? What did they make the beat with? They had 24 hours and um, they Googled um, beat and then they spelled it like the vegetable fruit thing. Hold on. What? What? DJ. It's this song. 
pretty similar, honestly, in the worst way possible. The video is just <laughs> an Android screenshot <laughs> of the file. Oh, it's bad. I love it. <laughs> I love 216.mp3. It's almost as good as CBAP. Seven. Seven. Terrific. There was one note. He rhymed the word rap like nine times in a row. You know your cheap keyboards that like come with like the built-in oh, songs? Like the Casio keyboards? Yeah, that's what that is. The loser song. <laughs> oh, <laughs> fell off. I really wish they would have done too good for you from Camp Rock. <laughs> you know, compared to everything I've heard in this movie so far, that is the best song that I've ever heard. <laughs> Whatever major loser. You want to flick at the switch, and whoever's on the other end of that baby is gonna get soaked with gruel. So no one can see that giant pipe in the middle of the backdrop. No, now. that's part of the set. Yeah, the whole. I really hope we get the RV music when it starts coming out the pipe like I hate that music. My associations with that movie are even worse now that that video bombed. <laughs> well, our lake is green, our bunks unclean, safety here is unattainable. This song is already better than the rap song, at least. Sounds like a VeggieTales song. That's mainly because he sounds like Larry. Yeah, he does. Hit it, Lawrence! <laughs> Plankton in the bubble bowl be like, the win it takes two. It's the thrill of one more kill. Run it up in big block letters. Hang it up on Man, my gruel pumping machine isn't working. Darn it, that relatable feeling when the gruel pipe is not working. Mr. Cow? Four. No. Yeah, the last one was a three and that one was a four because that one objectively had more notes in it, at least. That had more than one note. It was really annoying. Fred conceived it. Of course it's annoying. <laughs> Even if the other one didn't have a chorus, it was just like... Mm. No, 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 no. Oh, guess what? I bet it's going to suck him in there. Because it's set to suck. <laughs> That is a joke from not this movie. And it's not even like subtle. It's not even like a good joke either to steal. It was fine in Tommy Boy and only Tommy Boy. His underwear has a K on it. It stands for okay. I wanna see these breakaway clothes. Those definitely weren't meant to come off or anything. Well, that didn't go as planned. Well, that happens. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? There's Fred not getting the girl he's supposed to be with for the billionth time. We're going to change girls every movie, and then this one we just stop. He's had like five love interests, and none of them work out. Well, campers, it's a sad day here at camp. I want a pee pee. We bury Fred. Is he dead? Why we'll always be better than the kids at Camp Superior. What? Did they just lock the hole? <laughs> they did, and it made a car sound. There's like a car battery hooked up to the stump and, and it's only there to lock it. But if the battery dies by next year, they just can't get in. I like the idea of that one kid just carrying around a fob for <laughs> camp. It, it's just tree fob. Tree fob! Tree fob, I hate you. It's not a key fob, it's a tree fob. Uh, <laughs> it's like the most throwaway gag ever. Uh, <laughs> most is most unsafe summer camp that has ever existed. But I met my true family there. But I made good friends along the way. And the real camp Freds were the Freds we fretted along with Fred. Okay, now it's time to watch Fred for the Fredening. Alright, Brandon, you hold it. Let's make this happen. Alright. Now pull the couch out from under me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, Fred tier list. Fred 1, Fred the Fred. Fred 1 is... Um, S tier. Yeah, as far as like the scale of Fred movies goes. It was kind of just funny the entire way through. Yeah, Fred 1 was good. Yeah, Fred 2 sucked. It was D tier. For this era, the second movie was always the worst. Yeah, I don't know why they like made it higher quality like technical wise and then it was just bad. I was a little mad that it took about an hour longer than I thought it would for that movie. Movie to end. Should have ended like when they found out that the guy wasn't really a vampire. Yeah, but then they just kept going around the circle for like an hour. I'm a vampire. I'm not a vampire. He might still be a vampire. Right, you're the only vasect I mean. Fred 3, Camp Fred. Fred 3. Fred Camp 3 Fred. Is, is the most C tier movie I've ever seen. And that's <laughs> on the scale of like bad movies. It's just C tier. The first movie is the best movie by like a lot. If I had a choice of dying and watching Fred 3, I guess I could watch. 
watch Fred 3. Fate of Fred. Well, if you enjoyed this video, check out our other couch videos. It's in our In Real Life playlist. Or check out this video that YouTube thinks you'll like. Watch us on Twitter and follow us on, on the comments section. Have a day. Have a day. Yeah, I got have to a, say have this a, time. Have a stroke.